Okay, so we're going to try a little partner activity now and you can see I've got my trusty sidekick here who's going to help me out um, and we're going to have a bit of fun together, hey? Alright, come over here mate. So we're going to do a partner battle now. Now we always like to start a partner battle with a bow of respect, so I'm saying I'm going to play fairly and kindly, not going to hurt you, but I'll probably beat you. What do you think? You think? Oh no, I don't think so. I think you can do it. All right, so bringing your hands up to your chest and we're going to bow to each other and we're ready for a battle. So this one's called Knee Slapper. So I'm going to try and touch the outside of my partner's knees here and he's going to try and do the same to me. First person to three wins the battle. You ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, he's got one. <laughs> one all. Congratulations. Well done, all right, I think we need a rematch. We're gonna go and have a rematch and you guys okay. have a turn. We are going to jump into another partner battle now. This one's called toe-to-toe -to -toe fencing. So I've, we've set ourselves up with a long sash here, but you can use anything that helps you to get a straight line. You might already have a line in your carpet or your tiles that you can use to um, for this game as your guide. So we're putting one foot out in front. So we've got our left feet together, toes touching, and your right foot is going to go behind you, behind your foot in front and touch the heel of your foot. So straight away, you are already testing your balance, okay? Now, oh, we forgot. Before this partner battle, what do we always do? A bow of respect, excellent. Okay, let's go back to setting ourselves up. So left foot in front, right foot touching, toes touching our heel. We're going to take one hand behind us and grab your partner's hand. And the first person to get their partner off their line three times wins this battle, okay? So we're testing balance. Focus, resilience. <laughs> Not all about, oh! <laughs> now, notice that we're on a nice soft surface here, so. Make sure that you are set up in a similar way. Okay, that's one nil. All right, ready to go? Okay. Now, this is not about strength. There's a lot of factors here. Oh. <laughs> Two nil. All right, one, one more, one more. All right, up to jump quickly, left toes together. All right, foot behind you. Right foot behind your foot, excellent. Okay, look your partner in your eyes. Get your battle face on. Okay. <laughs> Always determined this time. Oh, no. Oh, I think we're going to finish off now with a few poses. Nice stretch. A bit of relaxing time. So we're going to come back to that pose that we start a lot of our activities with, which we like to call mountain pose. So having a look at your feet again, set them up that they're parallel to one another, a bit of a space in between. Soft knees pushing through your feet. If you try lifting your big toes, second toes, third toe, fourth, and your little toes, spread them right out as far as you can. Then you're going to push them back one at a time into the ground. So your toes are really spread out, pressing into the ground, heels into the ground, giving you a nice sense of being really strong and balanced. Big shoulder roll up to your ears and back and down, fingertips reaching to the ground. Nice big breath in through your nose and out. We're going to breathe in and as we breathe in, we're going to let the arms float up as slowly as you can. Just pause at the top and arms coming down nice and slowly. tip our body weight to one side and as you breathe in and then out you're going to lift one foot off the ground and place it against your leg so it might be down against your ankle or on your calf just not against your knee pushing against your knee if you want to bring it higher you can bring it tuck it right into the top of your leg but wherever is comfortable for you 
if you're feeling a bit wobbly, which is normal, have a look at something on the ground that's not moving. Focus on that spot. And when you feel ready, breathing in, arms coming up high, holding at the top in our tree pose. Just let the leaves of your tree, the branches, just wave gently from side to side in the air. Bringing your branches down nice and slowly. Releasing the foot, coming back to our mountain. We're gonna tip our body weight to the other side this time, the other foot, and lift the other foot off the ground. So remember your ankle, your calf, or you can go right up high, completely up to you. But like I said, if you're wobbly, look at that spot on the ground something that's not moving oh there you go you got it and if you fall out of that pose it's so fine just come back and try it again bring those branches up high when you're ready let those leaves wave in the wind and coming back down nice and slowly coming back into our mountain pose big breath in and out. Share a smile with your partner. Thanks very much. Hope you had fun trying some of these activities today. We'll see you next time at Blue Earth at Home.